Ladies and gents, so it's time for bout number 18. This is a UAR lightweight bout. Introducing your first fighter into the blue corner. Representing the Snake Pit MMA, please welcome Andrew Dent. <laughs> Turn into the cage here for the first time, I believe, since 2019. Looking to bounce back into the wing column in this light lightweight contest against Jack Hardy. Ladies and gents, could you please welcome his opponent into the red corner, representing TFT MMA. Please welcome Jack Hardy. Making the walk to the cage, Jack Hardy. Very long range striker. Last time out, he dropped the decision to Jeff Aka, who we've seen earlier tonight. We'll be looking to bounce back into the wing column with a big performance here. Yeah, well, both men are. Um, you know, Hardy. Dropped his last fight. Then was on a four-fight skid, not competed since 2019. But obviously, we don't know what Dent has been doing since 2019. He could have been training that whole time and fixing all these flaws. We don't know. I think it's important, though, for both of them not to be thinking about that. And it, it, it's not about you can't like let that play on your head. Like, oh, I lost my last fight. I, I desperately need to win this. Just need to win. They just need a fight. Like, they just need to go out and they just need to fight how they fight. Den seems very relaxed, signaling the people in the crowd. Smiling. Hi ladies and gents, this is bout number 18 of this evening's card. This is a UAR lightweight bout, first of all introducing your fighters. In the blue corner, age 34, standing at 5 foot and 8 inches. He's an MMA record of 6 wins, 5 losses and 1 draw. He represents the Snake Pit MMA. He weighed in at 70.5 kilograms. Please give a big warm welcome to Andrew Dent. 
facing him across the cage is his opponent in the red corner. He's aged 27. He stands at six foot two inches tall. He's got an MMA record of three wins, two losses, and one draw. Representing TFT MMA, he weighed in at 70.6 kilograms. Please give a big warm welcome to Jack Hardy. Your referee, Paul Crosley, was scheduled for three three-minute rounds. The action is about to begin. Good deep breath from Hardy. Referee checks both fires already and we're underway. Touch of gloves to get things underway. Both but low kicks at the same time. Dent just looking to fire big bombs in with his hands. Hardy's managed to back him up against the fence. Hardy clearly the taller ranger man between these two. Let's see if he tries to use that to his advantage. Lovely high kick there, the lead leg. Dent looking for the takedown. Shot failed. So they're quite a tense, tense start from both fighters. Beautiful Lovely takedown by takedown. Hardy. Hardy wanting this back on its feet. Nice kick to the body there from Jack Hardy. Inside leg kick, but Dent replies. Dent needs to do something about how how easily he's getting backed up to the fence. His corner have just asked for him to work off the fence there as well. Nice calf kick. Spinning back fist to create a bit of room. But it's, he needs to keep pressing after he... <laughs> but he's got Hardy to back up a few times and then not, not pressed his advantage. Hardy just stalking, measured. Using long strikes, not getting, not putting himself in any danger. Good left hook as a counter. Didn't quite land, but then lands his own calf kick. Dense movement's very interesting. He's circling around the right. He's switching to southpaw momentarily to try and fire off a back hand. Jack just keeping the pressure on here, Jack Hardy. Dent appears to be almost trying to claw at that lead Move hand of Jack. I think that calf kick hurt Dent. Dent moved a little bit funny afterwards and was trying to fire his own back. He's moving a bit gingerly now. Another oh big God. leg kick. Dent looks hurt. Ooh, Hardy, Hardy needs Hardy to be careful. To talk, he needs to be careful. He can't just close the distance like that. He's putting himself at risk. He's putting himself in range of Dent. Those leg kicks are doing serious damage. You can see the bruising already starting to form on the calf. And now Hardy. Dent's left leg. Yeah, now Dent switched southpaw, so Hardy's just working the right leg now. Switch back to orthodox. I have a feeling another calf kick's coming soon. You can see the reddening on the leg of that, the left leg of Dent. Good management of range from Hardy. Going up top there, but like you said, he does need to watch. He got a little bit excited, came in, and he got clocked on the way in. Just, he's, it's hopefully for him, he's, he's learned his lesson from doing that. He got off lightly, and he doesn't do that again, because it could be catastrophic. Like, Dent's got power. He certainly does, yeah. He's certainly got power, and it's like, He's almost doing a little bit of a, of a wood leap, like he's backing himself to the fence, backing himself to the fence, just waiting to like explode off the fence with his right hand. It very much looks like as well when Dent's coming forward, he's almost trying to pull the arm down of Jack to land that big right hand on his way in. Mm. Car kicks, of course, sorry, becoming so much more popular now in MMA. Like the new thing almost, isn't it? Every now and again you see this happen. It's a, it's a direct response to people's boxing getting better and people being able to, like, people are using the jab more and the uh, weight is more on their lead leg. Um, and here we go. Dent open up with a car kick of his own. And just get, managing just to get his leg out of range that time. Hardy looking a lot more relaxed now than he did at the start of the fight. He's really settled into this, I feel. Dent eats a left hand there coming forward. 
heavy on that lead leg as well this time. So just stance again. Momentarily happens to South Paul. Ben's landing a few calf kicks of his own, but just don't seem to have the sting on it the Hardys do. Lovely Ooh. kick up the middle. Beautiful front kick. Ben Hard just ate it though. Hardy done a good job there. Look, he went to rush in. He learned his mistake in the first round, so he stepped back, took his time, recalculated. But he's keeping this pressure on. Nice left hand there for Jack Hardy. And a good Straight jab again. Dent seems to be almost like running out of options. Like, like he's tried a few things, he's tried his tricks, and it's just it's not quite working. Millimeters away with that big right hand. Dent fires his own front kick. Huge right hand, right hand for Jack Hardy. Dent's legs seem to go a little bit after that. But then immediately firing back. Nice work from Jack Hardy this. Lovely head kick. Followed up with a few strikes. He needs to be careful. Dent does look on his way out, but Hardy can't. Well, he and can't now. He can't now. Jack Hardy gets Beautiful the win. Stoppage. Beautiful stoppage. Excellent decision to go for the calf kick there as well. Like, Absolutely. He started swarming Dent. Dent started to like almost sit on the cage, but then stood it, stood back up. Put, you know, and he's back in position to fire back. So Hardy just took a step back, blasted that low kick in, took Dent's legs out from underneath him and swarmed him to the ground and pound. Them cough finish. Them cough as well. How much did he compromise? So when he got his belt, when Dent got his belt wrong there, yes, his legs are underneath him anyway. If the legs already compromised and starting to go, it could drop to the mat earlier. Yeah, like there, there's definitely an element of that. Um, and it also, it's like the stance is less stable, so the shots can do more damage. Like you're not in a good stance to take the shots because your legs wobbly and you can't really put weight on it. Yeah. Beautiful work from Hardy there. You can just see what that means for him as well, getting that win. It's a perfect way to bounce back. Look, it was a tough loss for him against Jeff Acker. Back in the win column, and now no doubt. All right, ladies and gents, can you put your hands together for both of our warriors in the cage, please? We have your winner in the second round by way of referee stoppage. And your winner in the red corner, Jack Hardy! Also, let's hear for you, runner up Andrew Dent. And with that, we move to our feature prelim bout. Grant Ogborn taking on Jamie Roper in a lightweight contest up next. At Rise and Conquer 10, live on LiveMMA.co.uk.